Okay, this is going to be a video on something I like to call chessboard vision. So, if you've been playing Train Yard, you're probably familiar with the fact that if you have two trains that are directly behind each other, like these two trains here, there is no way for those trains to ever merge. So, if no matter what I do, they are never going to be able to merge on the same square. It doesn't matter what piece you use, it doesn't matter what direction they go, it doesn't matter what track you draw, there's no way they can merge. And that's just because of how the game works. There's, there's basically odd trains and even trains. At least that's the way I like to look at it. And, uh, and I've noticed that some people just find this out from trial and error. So they'll, they'll try and get two pieces to mix together, and it just doesn't happen. And so eventually they kind of figure it out. Or uh, sometimes players will, will count the number of squares a train has to travel and try and figure out if it's eventually possible to get it to land on the right square to merge with the train. However, I think there's an, an, an easier way to, to actually figure out which trains are ever going to be able to match and which trains aren't. And the way to do that is something that I like to call chessboard vision. So uh, if you imagine the whole train yard grid like a chessboard, so with alternating black and white squares. So black, white, black, white, black, white, black, etc. White, black, white, black, white, black, white. If you imagine the whole board like that, you'll see that any trains that start from a station that's on a black square will always be able to merge with other stations that start on black squares, and vice versa. So in this example here, these two trains, because they're on a diagonal, would be on the same chessboard color. Uh, so we know for sure that they're going to be able to merge. And in fact, this train, if we think black, white, black, white, black, this train is also going to be on the same color, so it'll be able to merge with them too. So if we just go really quickly and do some, some tracks, we know that at some point those trains are going to be able to merge. So it's a really easy way of looking at the board and seeing right away which trains are going to be able to merge and which aren't. And you know for a fact that because these trains are beside each other, they're going to be on black and white, so there's no way they're ever going to be able to merge. If you want another way of looking at it, simply that trains that are directly adjacent to each other are never going to be able to merge, and trains that start on stations that are diagonal will always be able to merge. So yeah, that's about it. That's Chessboard Vision, and I hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching.